guys, it's Geet and welcome back to my channel, Fun Time with Geet. After a long tiring day of doing homework and worksheets, we all want a quick and easy snack to binge on. Yes, today I will be showing you guys my favorite after school snack, potato wedges. So, let's get started. For this recipe are potatoes I prefer leaving the skin on for a more crispy touch some salt some black pepper powder and dried pomegranate powder that is an optional ingredient and it adds a tangy note to it I prefer you use it and red chili powder you also need some olive oil some oreganos and chili flake cheese and a mixing bowl so let's dive into it the first step is to cut your potatoes as big or small as you wish first you cut it down the middle and then turn it and cut it down again as in, in quarters then you take each slice and you cut it once again like this after cutting them you put all your potatoes into a bowl then you add salt to taste, black pepper powder, dried pomegranate powder, I'm adding red chili powder if you don't want to, it's totally optional. After this you add some chili flakes. some oreganos and lastly we put in some olive oil and then we take our forks and make sure everything is nicely mixed After the mixing is done, these are ready to be cooked. I'm going to be cooking them in my air fryer. If you don't have it, you can either saute it in a pan with some oil or you can bake it in an oven. Either way, they turn out just as delicious. I have put my air fryer for preheating at 200 degrees Celsius for 10 minutes so that it will be nice and warm for my potato wedges. If you're going to use an oven or an OTG, you use the exact same temperature. Now let's put it in. We put all of them in and spread them out a bit so that it's nice and evenly cooked. Now I put it in for 15 minutes so that it's nice and crispy. This smells amazing and it is ready so let's go ahead and turn it off. The potato wedges are out of the air fryer and look, they look amazing. Now, one should always make the food look presentable. So I will be using some cheese and some salad leaves to make it look beautiful. I'm going to create a bed of salad leaves on my plate. It makes the food healthier as well. already looks so good. Now we're going to put our potato wedges. I've also put a bit of ketchup in the center to make it look much better and ketchup goes with everything. Final step to garnish it with cheese. This is cheddar cheese I'm using. I like cheddar cheese the most, so I decided to use it. And there we go, an amazing snack. You can eat this whenever you want, for movie night or when you just want a nice pick-me-up. 
I love this snack so much and you guys have to try making it. And when you do, don't forget to let me know in the comment section down below. Now it's time for the taste test. Let's do it. Mmm, this is amazing. It has a nice tangy note from the dried pomegranate powder that we put in. It even has the right amount of spice from the pepper powder that we put inside as well. I absolutely love it. You guys have to try it. Thank you for watching my video. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share and comment down below what else you would like me to do. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you know when I upload more videos like this one. Sayonara!